AR-60 I'm so happy Anyways, uh, uh I, I finally hit it after 635 days, yay Uh, anyways, I'm just gonna go over a little count overview After playing this game for almost two years And, uh and uh, this is just kind of on a whim, so I'll just try to make this as quick as possible. So starting out, I'm gonna say my uh, my favorite character out of all uh, all of these characters that I have. And uh, if it wasn't obvious, it's Coco Me. She makes the game fun again because she's just a really balanced unit. I feel like out of every single character, and I really. I really like how smooth her playstyle is and how she fits into pretty much every every team possible. Besides Kokomi, my other favorite characters would probably be Eula, Ito, Zhao, and uh, I guess Hu Tao. But she's kind of an exception. I played her for a little bit too long, so I don't really know how I feel about it right now. But out of all my characters, my most played right now is Kokomi. It's been that way since... Uh, I used her since she first came out whenever whenever the hell that was uh, I was I was kind of hesitant on pulling her because I didn't really like her at first I thought I thought that she was gonna be my least favorite character out of every single character that was released in Inazuma but I was wrong uh, I ended up trying to pull for her on kind of a whim and because uh, I saw that Albedo wasn't getting a rerun soon enough so I just pulled for her and uh, I'm very thankful that I got her in the end. Anyways, here's an overview on all of my characters that I have. Uh, I have pretty much every, almost every single character in the game. I am lucky in that. Shut the hell up, you goofy ass bit. Uh, anyways, uh, I pretty much have almost every single character in the game. The only one that I don't have that I want is Kazuha. I wanted him at his first rerun and I did try to pull him but he's the only banner out of every single banner I am pretty sure right yeah out of every single banner that uh that has ever existed he's the only one that I've ever failed on and that was because I pulled for Klee before because I wanted to complete my monstat collection so and I kind of regret that because I never used this stupid little Stupid fucking rat. Besides that, I've pretty much gotten every single character that I want. I and for any regrettable pulls, I don't really have any. I like every single character that I've ever pulled, with the exception of Yaimiko. I only pulled her because uh, I play Honkai, and Yai Sakura is really cool. So I thought Yaimiko was also going to be cool, and she wasn't. She's really lame, and to this day, she's like, yeah, she's the only story quest that I haven't done besides Yellen's. I'm saving Yellen's for in a couple of days from now. I want to do it before the next update drops. Uh, yeah, Miko's chapter is the only one that I've, pr this is like the only story quest that I've ever delayed on. How many updates has it been since there? Yeah, two updates now, that I, and I haven't done her story quest yet. Why? Uh, I don't like her. That's it. I really don't like her. Uh, besides the Aimiko, I pretty much like every other character that I have. That's a 5 star. I don't want to get into the 4 stars. I hate a lot of the 4 stars. Oh, and of course... Uh, besides that, I'm not looking forward to any other 5 star. Unless they're gonna randomly someday release a certain green-haired girl that has something to do with Amber and uh, I'd really like her. That'd be really cool. Anyways, I'm gonna uh, show my Spiral Abyss stats to show how long or how far I've gotten in Spiral Abyss and how many three st or nine stars that I've gotten on floor 12. I've gotten 36 stars since at least at least this time. I guess. 
I mean, I've probably gotten it before, because whenever I pulled Ganyu on her first banner, that's probably when I started getting 36 stars, but ever since then, I have 36 starred every single abyss up to this point. I don't think... Yeah, no, I have Yeah, I haven't... Besides the start of the game, I've never missed a 36 star on abyss. And after looking through this real quick, uh... I thought that my most used character would be someone like, I don't know, Bennett or Jing Cho, but for some reason my most used character is Diona. Uh, I don't know why it's Diona. I guess I it's making up for the fact that I don't have Zhongli and shields are like the best thing in this game. Fucking stupid ass rat, always on over. She's cool I guess. I like her. She's fun. I don't know. I just, I, if I had Zhongli, I'd probably never use her again, maybe. I don't know. Besides that, my map exploration is... Uh... Max. Maxed, maxed, not maxed. I haven't really done the chasm that much. I should be maxed on all the Inazuma Islands, right? Yeah, I am. Yeah, so I'm maxed on all the Inazuma Islands. Chasm I'm not done with yet. On top of that, I don't think I'm done with the underground yet. Yeah, 92% on the underground. I'm, I'm close. And then, uh, Ekonomiya, I'm kind of ashamed. I haven't even... <laughs> I haven't even unlocked some of the, uh, teleport waypoints. I probably should do that, though. I really like Ekonomiya. It's probably... It's probably my favorite place on the entire map. This place is just really pretty, and I, I kind of wanted to save her exploring it. The only reason that I haven't explored this entire place is just because I wanted to savor it. And, uh, I should probably fully explore and also do some world quests here because that'd be pretty fun. Uh, besides that, uh, that's pretty much my entire account after 600 and... How many fucking days was it? 635, yeah. 635 days. Uh, that's my account. Uh, technically it's not the 635th day. Uh, it's actually five days after. Why? Uh, because I forgot to do this video. I was kind of lazy and then... Uh, a certain something happened this morning with a certain green-haired girl and then it made me remember that I was gonna do this video anyways uh, yeah that's pretty much my entire account after 635 days uh, will I keep continue playing this game every single day uh, yeah do I want to I do kind of want to play this game still. I really like this game. I've been waiting for this game to come out ever since closed beta test 2. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't want to get into a whole life story on how I got into Genshin and all that stuff. Anyways, I'm thankful for Hoyoverse that they've made this game. It's pretty much like my, my childhood dream into a game. And I'm looking forward to the 3.0 update. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much everything. Bye.